Hello, I'm Nicole Mitchell, manager at Frying Pan Farm Park. I am humbled and honored to introduce the winners from our 2021 Fairfax Parks Student Poetry Contest. As a park manager, I get to witness the many visitors who come to our parks to seek green space, to seek reflection, to find inspiration. As you'll hear from these young poets, our parks have quite literally been the breath of fresh air we have all needed during the past year and the many challenges of the pandemic. Please join me in celebrating our three winners from the sixth through eighth grade category. Hi, I'm Caitlin Hubbard, a sixth grader at Mosby Woods Elementary. My poem is called The Wind a Blowing. The wind a blowing, shaking leaves from the trees to the ground. The wind a blowing, commanding grass to tickle my toes. The wind a blowing, transporting seeds eager to grow. The wind a blowing, helping the black raven fly as it crows. Here's the earth working in harmony while we're still striving for equality. Here's the earth working perfect circles while we're still fighting little squabbles. Now, as I peer down from where I stand, I see litter on top of land. Now, as I peer up from where I lay, I hear pollution with a mean message to say. Now I see I live in a world with poverty. Now I see I live in a world with cruelty, but I also see a world with family. I also see a world where people think selflessly. So let us fix the wrongs and make them right. So the earth will once again be a wondrous sight. Fairfax County has done their part by placing parks around the city. So let us do our part to protect the parks and keep them pretty. Hand in hand and one by one, that'll be when we overcome. To fix the messes we've created, so we'll get to live in a world that is finally healing. Thank you for listening. Hi, my name is Sung Hee and I'm a sixth grader from Haycock Elementary School. The name of my poem is The Best Gift of All. Hear the parks, raindrops drum a melodious beat on the canopy of trees. Breathe in the fresh air, the smell of lake and wet wood tumbles through the winds. Behold the dance of colors, spring splashes a blob of red, green, and yellow. All Fairfax parks have great gifts to offer, each one as enchanting as the other, as unique as no other, but perhaps the most magical gift of all is the gift of always, a solemn promise. Masks can't cover up the joy. Behind our masks, we're all smiling. We're waving at each other that we'll be together soon. During a time of division and confusion, Fairfax parks are a promise we make to ourselves. We'll return, we'll be stronger, and we'll thrive. Happier day. Hello, my name is Sumeya, and I'm a seventh grade homeschool student in Falls Church. The name of my poem is Escape from Zoom. Each one of us is familiar with the despondency and gloom that come from being a slave of the screen and logging into Zoom. After suffering day after day, week after endless week, my family and I ended up finding out that there was an antidote we could seek. It wasn't very difficult, it didn't cost a penny. We could do it any time and we could choose one of many. This remedy, you see, was all the beautiful parks, overflowing with greenery, greenery taking hold of our hearts. The, we would don our masks and stay apart and head out to the nearest trail to bask in the sun and let the breeze in to, to push on our unfurled sail. With our energy renewed, our bodies recharged, we would return to our humble abode, being thankful for the parks around us where we could always lighten the load. Thank you.